Welcome back. It is time to go to the Pinpoint Weather Center for a look at that warming weekend forecast. Hi, Candy. Hi, Jim. It's going to be a great weekend to head outdoors. So just make sure you have your water, your sunscreen, your glasses, maybe a hat because it's going to be sunny and it's going to be warm. So happy Friday, everyone. Let's take you outside. Here's what it looks like in downtown Baker. So mostly clear skies right now. We can see a little bit of a haze in the distance and that is due to the air quality. Well, temperatures not so bad. 77 degrees right now. Humidity is at 26% and the winds are light out of the west at 6. Out of the Hatchby, a little breezy there so you can see, but mostly sunny and the temperature is 61 degrees. Humidity is at 45% in those winds coming in out of the northwest at 14. Around Kern County, 76 in Delano, 79 in Button Willow, 59 in Pine Mountain Club, 61 in Tehachapi, 75 in Mojave, and 72 out in Lake Isabella. Our high for today, 79 degrees. So that is only 2 degrees above the average of 77. And the record? Guess what? 99 degrees said back in 1931. They can keep it. We don't really need it just yet. Our sun's at 734. So it's been breezy today, especially uh, towards the mountains. Uh, you can see it right here in near the desert communities. We're disgusting anywhere from 25 to 30 miles per hour. But however, it's below advisory levels. So I don't um, I don't expect this to get any worse as we head into tonight. But just expect, you know, a light breeze as we head into tonight and tomorrow. So what is really happening? Let's take a look at the uh, weather pattern as we welcome the weekend. High pressure is going to remain in control right here keeping us dry and keeping us keeping us warmer at least until Sunday by Sunday we're tracking a weak disturbance that will continue moving and it will shift just a little south enough to change the weather pattern just a little bit it's not going to produce any rain for Kern County but we'll see kind of a cooler air uh, filtering in the Central Valley which will keep temperatures kind of on tap in the low 80s so we'll see a slight cool down it's not going to be uh, quite significant but then by the middle of next week high pressure is going to build back in which means that, yes, we're going to see a significant warm-up. We're talking about upper 80s and low 90s for the middle of next week. So, yes, make sure you enjoy this weekend. 84 in Fresno tomorrow, 84 in Sacramento, 63 in Morro Bay in Los Angeles. You're looking, well, almost 80. Air quality moderate with an AQI of 77. And tonight, mostly clear skies. It's going to be very comfortable in the low, the low to mid-50s tomorrow. Yes, you're going to feel it. It's going to be low to mid-80s on the valley portion of Kern County. Up in the mountains in the current River Valley, look for low 50s tonight. Upper 70s for Wolfer Heights and 70 in Fraser Park. Upper 60s in Bear Valley and out in the desert. Look for 84 in Ridgecrest. 79 out in Mojave. Let's take a look at that 70 forecast for you. And like I said, it's going to be warmer. We're going to feel it. Just, just get into the habit of drinking plenty of water if you're going to be out and about. We're going to cool down just a little bit on Tuesday. You can see it right there by with 81 degrees. But then by Wednesday and Thursday, guess what? We're looking at 90s uh, for Wednesday. To have to be 70 tomorrow, 68 on Sunday, and mid 70s as we head into Wednesday and Thursday of next week. And finally, Lake Sabella, 78 tomorrow. And we warm up to the low to mid 80s by Wednesday and Thursday of next week. That's a look at your forecast.